If we just visit the index page or default page of our Metasploitable 2 server, we'll see some of the directories that we discovered in our Fuff and GoBuster scans. Another easy way to discover web pages that the developer probably doesn't want you to know about is by checking the robots.txt file. The purpose of the robots.txt file is to manage how search engines and web crawlers can access the website, and oftentimes if we check the robots.txt file of a website, we'll be able to find interesting pages such as admin portals and other sensitive pages. To see an example of this, let's go to the matilde slash robots.txt file to see the robots.txt file of the matilde website on our Metasploitable 2 server. Here we see multiple directories that the web crawlers are not allowed to crawl. This includes the directories passwords, config.inc, classes, javascript, OWASP ESAPI-PHP, and documentation. The passwords directory sounds interesting, so let's check it out. In the passwords directory, we're brought to a listable directory with an accounts.txt file in it. And inside that accounts.txt file, we see multiple usernames and passwords, and what looks like to be security question answers for some user accounts on the web page. 